Okay. Right, Australia's Mark Webber has really been in the news this week. He's been travelling very quickly indeed. Michael Maher spoke to Mark in Melbourne, so let's take you behind the scenes to In The Pits. What sort of an opportunity is being a test driver with this team? Well, it's crucial because you learn the F1 environment, the, the pressures that comes with the job, I suppose, driving with the team uh, at testing. OK, I'm not qualifying and racing the car, but it's, it's working with the team uh, in, in this environment, not, not in Formula 3, the not in Formula 3. It's, it's testing. We've seen it with Mika Hakkinen. We've seen it with a lot of good drivers. Panis, Alex Verst, these guys, testing is, is, is good because it gives you... Um, the knowledge of the car and, and working with the guys, it's good. It seems that the attitudes maybe changed to testing too, whereas before maybe you were a test driver, right? And you look sitting on the bench, I suppose, in a way, but it seems that the attitudes changed a bit because Hacken and, and people like Olivia Panis have shown the way, haven't they? Yeah, and also the role of the test driver has come even more crucial because these the manufacturers now are getting so, Formula 1's getting bigger and bigger and bigger, and the workload on everybody, you know, the mechanics, just everybody is huge and, the, and also the drivers. So when you've only got two drivers, uh, they get worn out pretty, pretty quickly. So it's, it's important to have maybe a third guy, a reserve guy or, or someone to share the workload and, and they need somebody they can trust and, and have a good relationship with uh, technically with as well. Yeah, do you have to communicate much with the drivers themselves or are you going through to the, the technical boss? Most of the time I'm talking with the engineers about the problems I have with my, you know, with developing the car, what, whatever programs we're developing on the day. Uh, we might talk, I might talk to the drivers about certain things which might be a problem which is uh, a bigger problem which is maybe there most of the time which we're trying to maybe fix as well. So uh, mainly talk to the engineers. Are you a workhorse? I'd like to think so. I like to think I put, I put a bit of effort into it, but uh, it's, there's a lot of guys in this pit lane putting a lot of effort into it. So, uh, but you don't mind. Yeah. I, mean, no. I, mentioned the, I mentioned, I mean, the money is pretty good too, isn't it? I mean, what's a ballpark figure? I'm not asking what you're earning, but yeah. what's a ballpark figure for a test driver? Ah, oh, for a test driver, you know, you're probably looking at um, above two or three hundred Australian to up to one and a half million. You know, that's, uh, you know, so it's, it's, it is good money. Um, but that's what the industry is about and there's so much going into it and they want uh, good people working in their teams. Yeah, Mark Webber certainly on his way and doing a pretty good job too.